I'm Dune, and I'm going to be looking at another game today. This one is called Off Peak by Cosmo D and Archipelago. It's another game that I just kind of downloaded randomly. Um, I downloaded it off Steam mainly because the creator has another game that recently came out called the Norwood Suite, and I'm familiar with Norwood, Massachusetts, and on that basis alone I was curious to check it out. And it had some very strange use of textures. And so does this game. Off Peak is a completely free game. You can download it off the creator's itch.io or on Steam. I'll put a link in the description. But yeah, it just seems very surreal. And I really dig train stations. But I really don't know much about what I'm in for. So it's first person controls. Yeah, see, like, I'm not sure what it is about the textures. I mean, here, like, the normal map is really strong. It's really... has a really reflective surface, you know? Catch all those little bumps, and the lighting's kind of dark. I think it, it creates a really neat effect. Ooh, can I... I don't know. Can't squish through there. I'm in a game art class right now, so I'm all about examining textures, but I'll just try to enjoy the game for the video. Service changes. Subway service suspended. Try swimming instead of taking the train today. A great idea. Honestly, it's really spooky how the clouds don't move. They're really pretty though. An interesting decision, and there's. Oh, is that why the subway is suspended? What is that? Anyway. Oh, look who it is! Hello. Slow subway. I mean, it's stopped at a crawl. I'm not surprised. The city's too much sometimes. Yeah, man. And I know you want to get on the train to Railway Town. I guess I do. Well, you're in luck, my friend. I had a train ticket all ready to go. Marcus hooked it right up. I'm not going anywhere, so it's all yours. But I screwed up. Again. The train tickets in tatters. The pieces fell out of my jacket and scattered around the station. Believe me, I know train tickets aren't cheap these days. But you'll find the pieces. I know you gotta catch that train. I guess it'll get started eventually. I believe in you, huh? <laughs> and the people you meet here. They won't be able to help you directly, but they may still want to talk to you. Others, maybe not. In either case, you might find the musings insightful. Or not. Anything goes. Oh, the circus. The way they treat those giants. They're just happy to take that circus money. What are you talking about? All that time and energy spent. What a waste. And because people I think I'm in a huff, because the circus didn't ask me to perform. Huh. You wish you could have been at the circus? It's a very blue. Uh, shoot, I don't know my string instruments. I'm not sure what he's playing. Oh, see you around. Oh, Marcus. He's got more to say. Born Tycoon. He runs the station like a virtuoso. You got a ticket from the station master? The fact that he lets me hang around. Why does he give me the tickets to faraway towns? <laughs> Maybe he wants you to leave. <laughs> but only the commuters can afford them now. I've known Marcus for 15 years, and I'm still learning from him. Whatever he does, it works. For him and his station. I don't know. His trains are suspended right now. Well, look who it is! Alright, time to move on. Head inside. Oh, there's something black floating on top of the station. Ooh. It's a very small thing right there. Run. Some people talk to you! Others well, talk amongst themselves. Just like a real train station. Get close to objects to activate, use, or take them. Okay. Ooh, nice floor. Can see this. Alright. 
what's going on over here. Very tall person. Well, it seems about time we start putting up with the status quo. That's the station rebels. Oh, he looks he looks interested. Worried. Excited. Hmm. The time is now. We can make a difference. Wait. Oh! Oh, he looked at me! Oh! You don't look so good, buddy. Giants at the circus. Oh, oh! I thought the skull was talking for a second. All right, they're really focused. Maybe we'll see them again later. Push! Oh, absolutely. Oh, into the floor. Tigers. We're into the circus theme. Oh wow. Oh, I don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't this. This is really funky. More like a museum than a train station, but even that's not as surreal as this. Oh, hey, there it is. Press I to show or hide this ticket. Okay. Oh, it's so funky. Fish. Oh, is that? I wonder if that's a real board game. It looks like one. Beelzebub. You know, as surreal as this is, an actual train station is going to give me a similar level of sensory overload. Like, I don't know if you've ever been to the South Station in Massachusetts, but like, they're always hanging up huge banners. Once they had um, advertising for Sprint and just everything was yellow and oh, it hurt my eyes. Oh, there's a map. How convenient. There's the whale. Snick. Pizza. Trains. Well, let's have a look around, see if we can find more tickets. Meet some more interesting people. Boy, they're staring at me. Oh, alright. Hello. No? Just gonna wiggle your fingers? Just stare at me without saying anything? At least she is reading. Have fun. Game design. Maybe the creator really made a board game. So focused. Right. Honey, I'm home. Okay. Music. Hmm. Oh. I like the funky particle effect. Looks like paint strokes. Absolutely. We got two. Take. Oh, are these music pamphlets? Rhythmic training. Let's take this one. Do I have an inventory? Hmm. Hey, what went by too fast? Leaf through my wares, but you still need to pay for it. Oh no! Oh no! 
probably can I give it back? I don't I don't have change. Hi. Most of the players have had to memorize all this by now anyway. Saxophone pieces are from the same guy whose vinyl collection found its way to Shiny over there. And the cello player? Are they sure about her? Honestly, I can't complain about my work here. Sheet music practically sells itself. Business keeps getting bigger as enthusiasts keep digging deeper into musical history. I've had several high school choral conductors request Spemin Allium. Piero Lunaire flies off the shelves. What treasures these musicians? What treasures these musicians have left for us? Uh, the owners, the original owners of these manuscripts, trust me to handle the business side of things. The consignment deals I have with them are quite fair. Although, unlike other types of people I deal with, these owners don't have any intermediaries. Such trusting people. While I myself can't read music, I always know what these computers really want, and what they're willing to pay for. Hello there. Huh. I wonder if this has any basis in reality. I've certainly seen my fair share of, um, transportation center performers, but, yeah, there's not usually enough of them to warrant, like, selling music to them. But I think it's a neat idea. What I don't- oh. oh! Um, what I don't think is neat is that I don't have money and- well, okay, maybe he didn't see me take it, because I took it behind his back. Will you talk to me? Hmm. More staring. Alright, maybe he didn't notice. There's the snake. A snake. I know I've seen him before. Rapture. Oxbow. Oh, there's an owl. Brewery. Main. Atrial. Move the site. It's kind of hard to read at this angle. Downstairs. Watch out for bananas, death, and people staring. Whoa. Oh, the platform, that makes sense. Very tall ceilings. Oh, this is shady. Shh. If you listen closely. Hear the sighs of old train long abandoned. They make these long, slow, deep tones all day. Are you here all day listening to the trains? Take any cookie you. Oh no, any cookie I want. They're all pretty stale. And don't ask me what's in them. You get what you pay for. Oh, then I'm. Oh, oh, eat. Oh, this is already a fever dream. Um. Ah, sure, give me the big one. Oh. I'm so glad someone's enjoying my cookies. I do miss the sun. Are we in like a universe of permanent night? How would you like to get it if you never got to see the sun? How would you like it if you never got to see the sun? I know people think I'm a crone. Try spending your whole day underground. Okay, I guess this person just perpetually stays here. Every morning I arrive here on my little rowboat, but the sun is just coming up, hitting the buildings a certain way. That's the only time I get to see it. I want to take that moment and bake it into a cookie. <laughs> Nothing brings me more joy than reminding these hardworking fools. In, sim in these times, they more than anyone deserve the simple pleasures. I don't understand any of that music that Giant plays on his big piano. I don't care about fancy beer, personality pizza, or tricky card games. Cookies and trains for me. Shh. Well, it's good to know yourself. Can I 
have another? Oh yes. Can I eat can I eat all the cookies? Don't mind if I do. Stuffing my face with cookies. Oh yes. Alright, no regrets. Oh! I got an achievement. Great. Oh, this is too dark to read. No it is. Citywide sub- oh, that's just the other sign. The same- there we go, yeah, this one. That we've seen before. Bumpy. Oh, is that a cat nun? Oh, it's a dark over here. Oh, oh, it's just spooky. I can hear the hum. Oh, oh, I fell down. All right. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I can get back up. That's good. You did the darkness. No. All right. There's a wall. Oh, so spooky. Let's head back up. Oh wait, no, what's over here? Oh! Oh! Uh. guitar. Funky. Oh my. Part of me wants to say I would love to meet the person who lives here, but I know I'm terrified of that possibility also, so maybe it's a good thing they're not home. Oh, what? It's beeping. Ooh. Here we go. Ooh. Here's some funky jams. Do, do, do. This is really cool. audio track, but I also love the train tracks too. Love it. Hey, we got an old train too. 3227. Can I sneak under here? No. Oh shoot. Oh, oh thank god I thought I was stuck. It'd be fun to be able to crouch under there. I like the variety of train cars. Yeah, like this game totally could have gotten away. Excuse me. Totally could have gotten away with only modeling one train car. There's several train cars. And like different kinds of trains. I've modeled a train car before. It's a lot of work. Oh, a person. Oh, yeah, me too. Jam out, buddy. Heck yeah. Alright. 
Oh, do you want to interact with me? Can I take his briefcase? He's in the zone. Have fun. Absorb the sun's rays and just... Yeah. Okay. Alright. What's this door over here? I wonder if this will let out to another platform underground. You know, like if it's symmetrical to where we were earlier. I don't remember this many stairs, so... Oh, more funky tunes! Oh, is there like a hidden nightclub? Oh. that. What are the other oh, skulls? Okay. Oh, I want board games. Your hair is very blue. I'm totally lost. Me too. But you know, somehow I don't feel lost. It, it feels calm and it's weirdness. This looks fun. All these little circles and essential gear. A lot of pieces. Yeah. I wonder if any of these correspond to the advertisements um, hanging in the main area of the train station. Oh yeah, there really are giants. I wonder if the person who made this is like a game student and they just had to do a bunch of board game projects. And then they put them in the game. I've done a couple board game projects, but only like had to professionally print one of them. It was a lot of fun though. I had a great experience. I made a lot of good friends. Oh, look at that bird! That's pretty cool. Neat ceiling too. Oh, hello! These games look pretty arcane. At first, people decipher them and play through them, and then they're done with them. They can't settle on what they like. It's always about what's new. Me, I like playing a few games, I'm really exploring them. I rinse my games. Maybe these aren't all brand new experiences. Just old ideas repurposed. Yeah. They'll always ask me if I'll keep the bar open later. But I don't mind letting them down easy. I've got a delicate balance to maintain at this place. You think adding more hours would simply offer more income, but it's never that simple. I also need to supply more drinks and deal with the shift in clientele. People like yourself. <laughs> Broke people. <laughs> Not that it's a bad thing. But I like routine. And I have my customers right where I want them. Giants drink for free, but only because the circus bank rolls their leisure activities. Hmm. Those two back there have been at it all afternoon. I don't know why. I don't care. Just give me that circus money. <laughs> okay. Someone once told me learning is like a special a spiral staircase. Higher you go, the more you come around to the same challenges. But you're at a higher level with them. Some neat things to say. Yeah, about games. I don't play as many new games as I used to. That's mainly because it's kind of harder to rent games or borrow them. And they can be expensive, but hey, now I'm playing more indie games. This one's free. Oh, he also says something neat about the giants. I guess most of them, if not all of them, work in the circus. And that's central part of the economy going on here? What do you have to say? Printing problems, errors. I'm not gonna tell you. Why not? Oh, she's got like green lipstick. Does she? Scooch the ear, yes. 
Oh, she's barefoot. Oh, what? Who else isn't wearing shoes in here, huh? But you, you got sneakers. Uh, oh, is he also barefoot? Yes, he is. Oh, that poor rug. Well, you can really kick back and relax here at the... I wish I knew what this place was called. No pity. Uh, a bright brewing? Is that what this place is called? Well, circus and music. Phantasmagoria. Oh, yeah, a giant wooden fitness elevator. Oh, wait, it's the giant door. Never mind. Funky. How many pieces do I have? Three? I don't remember how many I need. <laughs> oh. Okay. Ooh, ew. I don't like this. What is the next painting? I'm gonna go up backwards and turn around dramatically. Oh, a skull. Oh, ugh, no. I don't like this horror stairs. Ugh, it's an interesting scenario though, you know, I gotta look around turn these angles. Oh, uh, this kind of looks like that heart in um, Hypnospace Outlaw that you have to like scrub off people's web pages. Oh lord! Oh, it's a person! <laughs> oh. oh! Oh, it's two people! Okay, what is up with the skulls? How fun! Mm. This one's kinda neat, actually. And how high up are we going? I'm committed though. Hummingbird, octopus, dragon, woman, my new persona. Oh, I think we've made it. It's so hard to see. Oh. That's better. Let's go this way. Oh, we can look inside. Here are the seagulls. This game's so surreal. It can take you from a mood of like very calming situations to very unsettling situations. You really don't know what to expect. Oh. She doesn't know I'm waiting for her. Who are we spying on today? She could enter from anywhere, so this is the best place to keep a lookout. I mean, if you want to be creepy. I've been waiting for a long, long time. I'm told she passes through the station around this time every day, but I can never seem to find her. Red hair in an orange dress. Hmm. Could spot her from anywhere. And yet, if by some unlikely chance you meet her, please don't tell her I'm looking for her. Uh, that's my decision. In fact, you never saw me. Uh, 
for a second I thought she was just gonna like dissolve. Okay. I'm gonna grab my ticket. Yes. Be on my way. I do hope we run into this woman in the orange dress though. That'd be neat. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, that was terrifying. Oh my god. Oh lord. I. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, okay. Alright. I'll do. Oh. oh, this is from that weird dwelling, the red dwelling under the platform. That was scary. Does this count as a horror game? Mild terror. Oh, do I still have my ticket? Oh, thank god. I have my tickets. I may not have my sanity, but I have my tickets. Ticket scraps. Ooh. Let's just, yeah, let's get some Chinese food. Or. Suki is Japanese food. Grab peace, yes. I used to be a viola player, yeah? It was my first chair, first stand in my county youth orchestra. But I had my eye on the conductor's podium. Things being how they are, I sold my viola. But making ramen became a way to channel this old desire. The noodles are my string section. Ha! <laughs> ha! Each strand emits a textual, unified sonority. Pork or chicken, the brass section. Oh, this guy's committed. The protein of any meat is powerful and tonally dominant sustenance. Woodwinds are the glue of an orchestra. And so too are shallots, cabbage spinach, seaweed and myrama. Each leaf providing a nutritious unification to the desperate elements in the bowl. The, bo the boiled egg, a timpani of more protein. Corn kernels, the harp section. My broth is the music these instruments make together, steep slowly over 24 hours. Miso paste, chili powder, show you, all setting the key signature. When you eat this, you're setting the tempo with each slurp. Hot sauce controlling dynamics. Three dollops and you're dealing with a fortissimo. Each bite a few more measures in an unfolding symphonic narrative. But rather than filling an auditorium, it fills your bowl and your soul. I hope you can hear all that, because it's a little noisy over here, but um, my special today is green glass noodles with ostrich egg, whites, and cocoa powder. That's an interesting mix. Bojido over there can tell you if my recipes have ever backfired. But he won't. He never told you about my birthday cake ramen. Oh, birthday cake ramen. Marcus wasn't into it. But it was my best-selling ramen ever. Ha! Dedication to ramen will one day cause me a great injury. Oh, a prophecy. Ramen is a 16 hour a day job. Usually I stay here all night and sleep in the mushroom garden over there. Uh, what I need is a kitchen assistant. Someone to work for me who enjoys having their schedule imposed upon. Someone who understands who it is I'm dealing with every day. Uh, I know you're trying to catch a train, but... Maybe you'd like to stick around and chop some mushrooms? I know, I know. Hmm. Well... He didn't make me a great offer, but I do hope he finds a willing assistant at some point. Scorned woman. Hot sauce. Well, can I- Oh, yes! I can help you out for a few minutes. Oh, he won't even look at me anymore. Alright. Buddy, his kitchen's empty. Buddy, you're understocked. These two bowls of ramen. That's all he has. Where else haven't we gone? Oh. Oh, those three women are gone. Oh, I kind of want to go back and see if they're still up there. But you know, also, I kind of don't want to see them again. 
Oh, but they're probably gonna find me before I find them. I was train boarding on track five. Oh great, it's you, you know me. I know all about you. Ooh. I know you definitely don't have the money for a ticket. Well, somebody was feeling generous today. You're not the first one who has helped out, you know. You're lucky I don't call that guard standing over there. Look, I'm not being rude. Just get out of my face. I think you are being rude. On your way, track five is where we'll be. So, Luke, has you looking for his ticket pieces, hey? Oh god. Alright, the skulls, the cow skulls, there's a cult going on here. No matter how many tickets Marcus gives him, Luke can't bring himself to live here, to leave here. Well, considering your situation, I might be able to steer you in the right direction. If you're so inclined. I know Luke likes to frequent the fine dining establishments here. Even though the merchants would rather stay, would rather he stay far, far away. But he's been chummy with Marcus forever, so they put up with it. Luke likes to bartend, likes to barter with the music merchants. Not like he'll get anywhere doing that, but he persists. All right, well, we've been to the cafe, and we went to the music area, and we got ticket scraps there. Lap steal lessons for records. Knowing Shani, I don't think that's gonna fly. All right. I guess if we spoke to him earlier in our journey, that would have helped us. Let's keep going. Oh yeah, the, that's another board game. Oh, happy birthday. Track four, track three. Croton, Herman, Harlem, Yankees, Morris Heights. Ludlow, Yonkers. I think I know any of these places. Meow. Oh, she's walking a spider. And there's a dude. Hey. Oh, that doesn't say funky. It says lucky. Yeah. Oh, it's a ticket. Pizza. Oh, it's gonna be all like greasy. I mean, it looks like we need just one more. I built this oven in my backyard. Oh. Oh, yes. Mmm, delicious. Oh, I'm full of cookies and pizza. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's got some long hands. I can roll anywhere that needs a party, but the price has got to be right. Always. Let's have some more. Yes. Mmm. Oh, I'm gonna be so full. I'm not gonna be able to make it on the train. Have the roll me and eat. Yes. Mmm. Good. Delicious. <laughs> When we just sit at a piano. Can I? <laughs> Maybe the playtime was 15 minutes ago and he hasn't even warmed up. Easy books to cloak me when I'm trying to draw. They want to play the piano, but they're like, what do we do? This guy's just sitting here. No, I run your cares that much. 
gonna set Marcus. Maybe Marcus can help this guy out? Station Master. Maybe we can play a recording? Live music only, remember? Oh wow, I'm not allowed to play recorded music? And what am I hearing? Marcus Giants Union. Would Marcus really be upset that someone's hogging the piano? Hey buddy. Hey. Mm. Oh, it's a big fish. Oh, I hope he wakes up. Not too bad. Into the mouth of a cat. Glowy eyes. Oh, we've been here before. That's where the cafe is. Oh, I haven't been in here. Oh, wait. Oh, God. Yes, I have. Oh, not ready to do that again. Right now. Where's the final ticket? Right in front of me. Oh, I did not mean to take that many. Oh, I guess they're... Well, they're not free if you've got a record. I mean, if you've got a cash register. So they belong to a DJ or saxophone player or something. Had to downsize. Shame for him. I'm not too surprised. Marcus screens all my records. The station master checks out all your records, but he found no faults with this batch. 100% quality. I don't know why Lou tells people like you at all. Oh, gee. I wonder what I look like. Every morning I hear him playing out in the waterfront. Honestly, I wish I could throw his lap steel into the lake. No, I wouldn't play his blue. I guess it's a lap steel? It's an instrument. I mean, I think he's a good player. I just like oboes better. Well, let him play what he wants. Marcus tells me, oh, the commuters always want something new to put on at a dinner team at dinner time. That's why he sent me up right here, to get in their way so they can buy all these records. On sale, and I'm set for at least two months. One sale. Just one sale. Right now, I'm just trying to sell records to the lucky few who can afford them. Half of these people don't even have a record player, and they're my best customers. They simply enjoy the thrill of acquiring a new thing. Yep. Ugh. Well, I probably don't have money for these. And I probably can't even carry them all with me. But you know what? I've already taken a bunch of stuff today that I don't have money for. So, yeah. No soul control. No record player. No instruments. No money. No problem. Nice. Yes, I am a dedicated record collector. You took all my records. This is gonna be complicated. I'm gonna have to pay up one way or another. Alright, as long as I get to ride that train, I'll deal with whatever comes my way. Alright, so I have my tickets. Track 5's on the other side. Is there any other place I might want to check out? Somehow the layout of this place is making sense to me. And the map was actually pretty helpful. Yeah, this one right here. Cool, alright, here we go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, I wonder if those studios are still at it, seven, eight, yep. Nine, 
Did I skip eight? 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 14. All right, oh, oh the creepy woman. <sighs> okay, we're not up here. Oh, we didn't meet the, the orange one. The orange, the woman in the orange grass. Maybe she'll be on the train. I don't see her. Alright. Alright. Gonna brace myself. No? They're not there? Okay. I'd be oh did I fall or something? I'm really curious now. Um, I'm pretty confident that the person who made this is familiar with train stations, and you know it. it I mean theoretically, it's nice. It's, it's an interesting place to meet people, but in reality, like the train stations, I just feel like. It's neat to watch people, but there's just so many people like rushing to get to where they need to be. They're not really lounging. They're... I mean, some people are. Their trains are delayed, but it doesn't feel as relaxed as this, mainly because there's people everywhere. How boarding. Where are we going? Stanford. Oh, Stanford. New Haven. Oh, Connecticut. Northern Heights. Westport, Port Six Plains, Fleetwood, Bronxville. All right, let's go to Connecticut. Or wait, are we starting? In oh, it doesn't matter. Take me. I have a ticket. Yes. Hello. Tickets, please. Very good. Now, if you'll just board the train on my right here. Uh. Uh, that's your left. Oh my god. Stop. That ticket was meant for. Ooh, not you. Oh no. No, can I please get on now? Hmm. At first, I was okay with this little arrangement. But now, I'm having a change of thought. Oh my god, is this Marcus? Especially considering your sticky fingers with my merchants here. Oh no. Oh no, she's the one with the records, he's the one with the pizza, he's the one with the music. Oh no, they're coming for me. It's okay, I'll just cough up the pizza. Just taking things with a wonton abandon like you own the place. You're a bold one indeed. But now it's time for you to settle up, my friend. Considering your financial situation, we may have to get a little creative. No we don't. Alright, you can just let me on the train, yeah? They didn't stop me. Even? I've been always saying he needs another hand between that ramen counter of his- Yeah, sure, that's fine. I'll help out. Considering what you owe for that ticket, along with everything else you've acquired, I actually see this as a golden opportunity for you. Okay, but can I start my shift, like, when I come back? What if it's a one-way ticket? Kindly- Oh, guards. Kindly remove this vagrant from the train. No. Wait. Oh. Has a cultist come to my rescue? Okay. What the hell are you doing here, Muriel? Whoa. Hope I wake up on the train. Oh lord, no. No, this is the bad ending. No! No. I don't actually know if this game has multiple endings. Okay, Archipelago, which is a fun name, made the assets, and Cosmo D uh, put it all together. Well, that was very surreal. I really want to go back and not take anything and see if I can board that train. 
Oh yeah, the number with sweet coming soon. It is already out. I believe it is like ten bucks. Um, and more funky, surreal uh, environments and interesting people. And probably also some more jazzy music. Oh, that was something! Wow. I think it's it's definitely really neat. Um, where I'm coming from, like I'm in a digital media game development program right now at my school, and like we're always being directed how to make like really well. Like I I'm in a game art class right now. We're doing 3D art, and like it's very good instruction. But I also feel like sometimes, you know, it's still worthwhile making an experience that, you know, like maybe some objects are clipping through one another or the textures don't quite line up, but like, you can still make something neat. And I mean, this is just a free game, you know? I like that freedom. But I also know a handful of games that are commercial and, you know, they might have an error or two here and it's totally forgivable. Um, when the rest of your game's working well and people are having fun with it. So I thought this was really neat. Um, so I'm excited to get to try out playing indie games and just, you know, you make your own game, you can do whatever you want with it. You can make it weird. This is cool. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna go back and check out uh, and see if there's any alternate endings. And if there are, I'll add them into the video. But for now, uh, that's all. See you around! Okay, so... Um, I went back and I got all the ticket pieces without taking anything or talking to anyone. So now let's see if the ending is any different. Yes, I have my ticket. No! Is there a cow? The ticket was not meant for me. Oh, good Samaritan. Alright, so it looks like I still can't get on the train. But I'm a good person for not having taken anything. And also, I didn't realize it the first time, but this woman must be the one in the orange dress. It's kind of yellow though. So I didn't realize it at first. So... Yep, same ending. Okay. This is just my fate. Joining the circus. Oh boy. I'll just have to accept it. <laughs> 